Welcome to another edition of Fridays with Fred. My name is Fred Said. Today I'm going to go over a very important topic that I'm being called about from clients to ask my opinion, and it's simply this. Hey, Fred, I feel that today's market is just another housing bubble like we had back in 2004, 5, 6, and 7. So why not wait to buy so we can see what happens? You know what? It's a valid concern really is a valid concern. And part of me, believe it or not, honestly, kind of feels it's very similar to what we went through in 2004, 5, and 6, and 7. But these are, these are the, pro, these are the uh, pros and cons of that, that topic and what you should and should not do depending on your scenario. We do have a low inventory of homes. We have a lot of buyers out there. There's bidding wars going on left and right on properties in Orange County that are under seven or $800,000 consistently. Properties are getting bid up left and right. So yes, and that dynamic is very similar. And if you were to look at facts, there's no reason why somebody would doubt that this could be an artificial appreciation or artificial market, and that sooner or later it's gonna hit a ceiling and it could drop back down again. That's a valid concern, like I said, and looking at the facts, that could happen. Nobody's got a crystal ball. But on the other end of things, what I'm hearing and what I'm reading and what I'm researching and what I'm doing every day, some of the top economists, top advisors financially in the local OC market, Southern California market, national market in general, are saying, listen, guys and gals, this is not an artificial appreciation market. Yeah, it's kind of crazy right now because of the lack of inventory, but this consistent increase in appreciation that we've had from 2012 and now 12 months later to 2013 is legit. And the inventory will remain to stay at a lower level. Prices will continue to increase. And that's what's going on in the market. So it depends on your financial philosophies, what your intention is, and whether or not you want to buy now and get into this crazy market or wait it out for six months, 12 months, 18 months, see what happens. The positives if you wait, or if it really is a bubble, if it's really going to double dip, if it's really going to crash, hey, you didn't invest your money, you didn't buy a property and you wait and then buy if it drops. But on the other end of the spectrum, if this really is a legitimate appreciation and with time it will tell and you wait and you don't buy 12 months from now, 18 months from now, you will pay a higher price for a home, anywhere from 5% to 15% more. And potentially, if you're getting a loan, you could pay a higher interest rate on your mortgage. Rather than paying 4% average right now, you might pay 4.75 to 5.5% a year to a year and a half from now. So it just depends on your situation, but I would love to discuss this with you one-on-one -on -one with your scenario so I can better advise you directly. Contact me seven days a week at 949-272-0125 and visit our highly reviewed website at www.bestocproperties.com and tune in next week for another awesome edition of Fridays with Fred. Why? Because that's what Fred said.